Hawaiian client has updated to 1.21.44. Finally, so to get it, you can head over to horizon.download. Uh, this is going to be linked down in the description below. Together, actually, with my Discord server, where you can find many more clients just like this one. So I'd greatly appreciate it if you could join that. Anyways, here on their website, we can simply click on this green download button and the download will start automatically. Now here, as you can see in my downloads, I have the Horizon Injector. Um, if you already have this and you don't actually need to re-download it. Anyways, I can simply double click on this. It's going to open up and I can click on the green inject button and that is going to inject it for 1.21.40, which is fantastic. As you can see, it has finally being updated now if you appreciate me showing you this then of course i would greatly appreciate it if you could hit that subscribe button now this is slightly unfortunate seeing as a little more than a month ago um i made a prediction that ryan was going to update on the same day that 1.21.50 comes out and um that is kind of true within 24 hours of now the release Minecraft Bedrock Edition 1.21.50 is going to come out. Uh, it's coming out on December 3rd, um, so within 24 hours of this video, which means Horizon is going to be outdated again. So yeah, the prediction was joking, but I guess it was actually kind of true. Oh well, for right now at least, Horizon has been updated. Uh, if I'm probably going to briefly show you how to use this right now. If you want the full in-depth Horizon client usage tutorial then that will be linked down in the description below anyways you can press on the insert button and that is going to open up this area the click gui these are all of Horizon's utilities and you can click on them to turn them on click on them once again to turn them off and these ones with a plus over here you can actually right click on them and then that is going to give you their customization menu as you can see all customization menus are unique and some of them have more customization than others Anyways, for the rest, this should be pretty self-explanatory. If you're not sure what a utility does, then as you can see, um, hovering over that is going to give you a description in the bottom left-hand side. Why am I why am I getting a tutorial? Uh, anyways, for the rest, that isn't actually all that Ryan client has. Uh, in the chat over here, we can type dot help, and that's going to give us a list of all of the commands that Ryan client has. Now, these commands do still not work uh, on servers, realms, multiplayer, uh, whatever, the dot give command, all that stuff, dot game mode, it doesn't work. I made an entire video uh, on why that is, because everyone kept asking it, which will be down in the description. Anyways, here are all the commands. If you're not sure how to use a command, for example, the dot bind command over here, you can simply type the command in chat, and then it is going to give you the exact usage right over here. So as I said earlier, the command for um, opening up the click GUI is the insert button on your keyboard. Uh, if you want to change that, you could open up the chat and you can type dot bind click GUI just like this and then any button you want. For example, F. By typing in this, the bind of click GUI is F and I can press on F to open and close the click GUI. Fantastic. Finally, for the rest in the click GUI area, there is also this GUI section. Uh, these are specific things that will show up on your screen. A part of this GUI is the tab GUI, which you see in the top left. It works the exact same as the click GUI, except you can navigate it with the arrow keys on your keyboard, as you can see. Anyways, uh, for the rest, you can, of course, turn that off in here as well. There we go, we can turn all of those off, or you can turn on other options that are here to customize the GUI. Anyways, right now I've turned those all off and my screen is completely clean, except of course I can still use the click GUI. Anyways, for right now, uh, that was basically that. Of course, thank you ever so much for watching. Um, like the video if you were happy with Horizon updating and um, like the video if you're sad that 1.21.50 is coming out tomorrow. Bye-bye.